How to delete tracking cookies in Windows XP. Tracking cookies are something that's downloaded to your computer when you visit a website. They usually go unnoticed and you're not prompted for them. They're just little bits of information that the website saves onto your computer. So what we're gonna show you now is how to handle your cookies. When you go into Internet Explorer and you hit the tools menu, we can go down into Internet Options and we can go to the Advanced tab. Once in the Advanced tab, you get a little scroll menu. If you scroll down, you'll see options relating to cookies. This is where you can change how your computer is going to handle certain things. If you want to restore or reset all your defaults because you're not sure if something is set correctly, you can click Restore Advanced Settings and click the Reset button. If you also, during the reset, want to delete any personal settings such as your home page, search providers, and other settings that may have been affected, you can click Reset. It's going to go through and restore all defaults and delete all your personal settings as well. And you're going to click the Close menu. Click OK. It's going to tell you you need to restart Internet Explorer for all the settings to take effect. So we're going to click X and we're going to reopen Internet Explorer. If you want to more specifically just delete your cookies, you can go to the Tools. Internet Options and click Delete. When you do that, a window will pop up telling you asking what you want to delete. If you want to delete just your cookies, make sure just the cookies box is checked and click Delete. Then click Apply and OK. You've just now deleted your cookies in Windows XP and in Windows Internet Explorer. If you have a different browser, you may want to research how to specifically remove the cookies in, the, in that browser.